Well, a Muslim party in Belgium says it's preparing to campaign for setting up an Islamic state there. Two candidates from the newly established Islam party won seats in a recent municipal election. Let's discuss this now with Philip Klaas, a Belgian Euro MP. Thank you so much, Mr. Klaas, for joining RT. Now, the party plans to run in Belgium's national election in two years' time. What do you make of their achievements thus far? Well, of course, it's very worrying to see what's happening now. We see people from uh, with an Islamic background uh, forming their own political parties now and demanding, you know, the introduction of Sharia law and an Islamic state in Belgium. Uh, we've always predicted this, uh, but up till now, um, Muslim people uh, mainly supported uh, socialist parties and other leftist parties, but now they feel apparently confident enough uh, to make uh, their own party and to make their own revendications. And uh, this is uh, something really worrying, I think. Now, you know, many Belgium cities, including Brussels, have neighborhoods with mainly Muslim populations. Uh, don't you think it's yes. only natural for those people to want their representatives to be in power? Well, um, first of all, the, the people who come into our country, and I'm not talking about just Belgium, but any other country in the European Union, um, people coming into the EU should adapt to a set of values, I think, uh, should uh, respect the separation of the church and the state, should uh, be in favor of uh, equality of men and women, uh, in, in, in favor of the rule of law, freedom of expression. Uh, and when we see that people don't, don't accept this, and um, are going to be candidates in elections, well, that, that I think that's a, there's a big uh, problem. Uh, there's also a big problem with the fact that people who don't even have our nationality are allowed to vote for local elections in Belgium. And I think this should change. And first of all, also, we should uh, put a stop to this mass immigration of people coming from outside Europe and from mainly Islamic countries, people who cannot and will not adapt to our way of living in Western